I sort of abide by the philosophy that if you see something, it becomes real and you can have it. So if the buyers of these girls have been doing nothing but watching child pornography or pornography showing rape, showing sexual assault, showing all these things, it becomes real to them. They become numb. And now you've created a customer. You posted to your Instagram. Mm -hmm. And one of the things you said in that post was that you feel like it's your right and duty to fight for victims of sex trafficking. So I just wanted to get your take on why do you feel like it's your right and duty? Um, I'm a girl, I'm a woman, I'm a mom, I'm a human being. If those aren't qualifications, period, to be able to fight for the rights of others, I don't know what is. And I feel like, honestly, that we should have protests in the streets about this. I don't understand how this is allowed to go on in this day and age. And my only thought on why it is, is because enough people don't know about it. You know, I've, I've kind of gone really down deep the rabbit hole when it comes to child sex trafficking and all of that stuff. And in my own particular research and meeting with different groups and law enforcement and government agencies and all of that, no one could really give me the actual why this occurs besides, okay, it's supply and demand. We know all that, but who's creating the demand? 